the Fox 54 Tower Cam Network. Brought to you by Brighter Side Roofing. Pleasant conditions over downtown Augusta. We're just seeing clear skies across the entire Metro CSRA for this evening. That extends all the way to Washington, down towards Swainsboro, and even over towards Bamberg and Allendale. For low temperatures tonight, we're going to be much cooler into the 60s. 65 degrees in Louisville, 63 in Gibson, and 63 degrees for low temperatures tonight in Augusta. For dew points, everyone is remaining dry tonight. The humidity going to stay off towards the coast mainly from our backdoor cold front system, which is keeping us not only dry, but also cooler. For tonight, a low of 61 degrees. Pleasant and dry conditions continue. We're not monitoring any rain, and we're really not seeing that for the next about seven days or so. For tomorrow, it's going to start to warm up just a bit, 90 or 89 for that hike. Some areas could even see about 90 degrees, and that would be especially down towards the southeast. So warmer and dry for tomorrow. A breeze could be prevalent here and there, and if you're headed out for the lake to the lake for your Sunday, your Clarks Hill Sunday boating forecast is going to be 89 degrees, water temperature about 83.3 degrees, and the UV is going to be about 9.5. But if you're headed out towards the river, it's going to be a bit cooler. 87 degrees for the Savannah River, 9.6 for the UV. So UV is slightly higher and the water temperature, of course, is cooler, almost about by 10 degrees, 75.7 for that water temperature. Overall, warm and dry for tomorrow. And we're going to start to see a warm up as we head into about midweek with a heat dome moving in. 97 in Memphis by the time we get to about Wednesday, 99 in Nashville and 96 in Birmingham, 92 for Augusta, where we hit our peak for the next couple of days is mainly going to be Wednesday and Thursday when we're going to see temperatures into the upper 90s. 101 in Nashville for about Thursday, even Friday, 95 in Augusta. And then the heat just continues to return. And these are roughly about average for this time of year, especially it still being summer. For a regional future cast, all of the precipitation remaining off towards the coast. So hopefully you guys don't have any beach trips planned because you could see some showers here and there, maybe even some thunderstorms. All of the activity really staying off towards the east of Interstate 95. So just keep that in mind. If you're heading out of town, you're going to be wanting to make your way to the west. For the next seven days, it remains very nice and pleasant with temperatures starting to climb back into those mid 90s. And we're also seeing sun skies really prevalent throughout the entirety of this seven day forecast Friday and Saturday. Very low confidence for some pop up showers is definitely it's still a possibility, but we're really not expecting that much at this time. For overnight and morning temperatures, those are going to start to return to average into the 70s by the time we hit about Wednesday. But Wednesday and Thursday, keep in mind the heat index is going to be between 105 and 108. So it is getting hot. Ansley.